Hello friends, I have been gone for like a week and oh my god I'm so excited to be making a YouTube video again. I literally haven't had any time to build or like play sims or any other game outside of my streams but I have so many stories to tell. I'm so excited to be recording a voiceover. Oh my god, you're gonna have a good time hopefully listening to this one. <laughs> I'm very excited. So last week was the charity event. I've been talking about this charity event for weeks now and it ended yesterday um, as of the time that I'm recording this at least. It's currently Monday. This is gonna go up tomorrow so that's what I'm, that's where I'm at. But. I had the best time of my life with this event. I had done one stream when I recorded the last voiceover because I think I recorded it last Monday and I had done one stream on that Sunday and I had raised $26. I raised $355.69, which is incredible. And you might be like, wow, how did you do that? <laughs> Well, on Tuesday, I decided I was like, okay, I'm just going to stream early. Like, I'm just going to go live, do whatever I want. Like, usually I go live at like either 7 or 7.30. I went live at like 7.15, just out of nowhere. I decided to go live at like the most random time ever because I was like excited. I just wanted to do something. I don't even know. I was just having a good time. I just opened OBS and like started streaming and did that. And then suddenly, um, my whole chat filled up with a bunch of eggs. <laughs> and um, I got a little Simsy raid, which was a very intense experience. If you have ever been to any of my streams, you would know that I usually average around three to five viewers per stream. That stream, I averaged 400 viewers. <laughs> <laughs> which is insane um i had an amazing stream we raised so much money that stream it was incredible i literally i am so so grateful for kayla's raid that was the most amazing thing that's ever happened to me i was so excited and everyone was so nice to me i've never felt more loved in my entire life <laughs> But this has been like one of the coolest weeks of my life because I was like, oh my god, I'm so excited. I'm going to stream again on Wednesday and Thursday, which were all so really, really good streams. And I had like the most amazing time of my life. We raised so much money and like, I don't know, we just did so much stuff. We talked for ages. There were so many people hanging out. I was having the absolute most amazing time I've ever had on stream. And... I've never been more motivated <laughs> to continue streaming and to keep working really hard on my streams to make them better. Um, so I'm gonna be starting, uh, I'm gonna start streaming at least twice a week from now on. So I was only streaming on Sundays before. I wanna stream at least every Wednesday now, but I'm gonna stream tonight as well. So while you're watching this, that would be yesterday. But I don't know, when, the moment I'm done with this voiceover, I'm gonna go live and see what happens. But I'm just, I'm so excited. Streaming has never been more fun. There's so many people hanging out with me. Everyone's so nice. My Discord has been like such a fun time. The, but the charity event was so cool. There were so many cool people taking part. I watched so many cool streamers. I hung out in so many fun streams. I had just so much fun and it was genuinely like the coolest thing I've ever been a part of. I, I'm talking so fast and because <laughs> this is so exciting. I'm I'm just I'm really happy with how it all went. And I was my stretch goal was $250 because last time I reached 224 in my last charity event and that was over a whole month. That was the entire month of June. So I was like my like main base goal. You can't set it lower than 100 on Tiltify. So I was like fine, I'll set it to 100. We'll see how far we get. I wasn't expecting to reach 100 because, I don't know, with a small audience on Twitch, like I'm not expecting everyone to donate massive amounts because that's insane. <laughs> but I had really like low expectations, not low expectations, but I guess like realistic expectations of an amount of money I could raise. I had set up incentives, set up all these really fun things. I was having such a good time with it. 
then this massive raid happens with literally like 2,000 people. I'm not expecting it. Chat has never gone so fast in my entire life. You don't know how that was, okay? <laughs> if you've never streamed and you like, if you watch Lil Simzy streams and you're like, wow, she doesn't read my messages. <laughs> Why does she not do that? I don't think you realize how impossible it is. I have like a newfound respect for Kayla. I genuinely don't understand how she reads anything. The messages go by so fast and like, my chat's on my phone. I can only see like five messages at a time. And that is if I like close everything else and I'm only looking at the chat. And it's so hard to focus on because th it all goes pretty fast. Like by the time you start talking about one message, a new message comes in and like, you don't know how to talk about everyone. <laughs> so me being like the person who usually talks about literally every single message in chat, straight away felt, felt guilty. And I was like, oh my God, I don't want people to feel left out. But I think it was fine. But that was such an insane stream and I had so much fun. And then at the end of the stream, we were all like talking about like, oh, how long should I stream for? Like, what should we do? Who do we raid? And then everyone was like, oh yeah, we can <laughs> we can raid Kayla back. So I went, we went and raided Kayla again because she was going to stream. She streamed like Animal Crossing in the morning and then she streamed Sims at night, I think. So then we raided her again and it was it was just a really fun time we decided i was babysitting <laughs> she just like dropped them off at daycare and, and then i gave them back to her at, at the end of my stream so i had a lot of fun um i did some more sims building on wednesday and thursday and then i didn't stream until yesterday night <laughs> because i had so many projects due i had four projects due yesterday um well, technically today at 9 a.m., but I'm not gonna go and hand stuff in at 9 a.m. So I did my project and I handed one in at like 12. Then I handed two in at like one or like 12.30ish. And then I handed in my last project at like quarter past 2 a.m., which was really not good for me. And I was not having a good time. I have never made so many spelling mistakes trying to write that, um, like I had to like write research. I literally couldn't do it anymore. I didn't even check if I answered every single question. I just handed it in. I was like, I'm too tired. I don't even care anymore. And now I really kind of regret it, but also it's over now. So I can't change anything about what I've done. <laughs> so I guess we'll see if I pass or not. But I don't know. This week has been insane for me and I'm so excited to be able to make more content because this week has really just reminded me how much oh i'm sorry that was a loud noise <laughs> but this week has really reminded me how much i love streaming because i really really liked streaming when i started and then the thing with streaming is that it's very easy to get really demotivated if you have a stream that doesn't go very well because you're going for so many hours at a time um like i go for like two two and a half hours most streams um so if you're sat there and it's not going as well, it feels so much harder than if a YouTube video doesn't do that well because you have to deal with it while it's happening in the moment. And um, yeah, that just, <laughs> it, you're so much more aware of it when it's just happening while you're sat there and you're just like, wow, okay, I'm by myself today. <laughs> but it's just, it's been so cool. The past week has been incredible and I'm so, so happy. Um, so I, I cannot wait to stream again <laughs> and to keep streaming because I'm having so much fun. <laughs> so I, I've met some really, really cool people through this charity event and I've, I've just, the people that are in my streams hanging out now, they're all so nice. Everyone's just so cool and I'm really, really excited. I'm so happy that I joined this event because I wasn't even going to in the beginning because I was like... Uh, I'm a small streamer like I only just started like this year I only have like I mean when I joined the event I had like 300 followers on Twitch now I have like 700 <laughs> which is insane as well but I was like I don't want to be like the one small streamer that thinks they can do it which like that wasn't even the case there were so many streamers of all different kinds like all different sizes there were people that did their like first ever streams after joining the discord but everyone's was so supportive of literally every single person there and it was just incredible 
We raised, I don't know how much exactly, but over 196, <laughs> no, not, not that, 169,000 as a group, which is incredible. And I'm so excited and I'm so proud of every single person who was part of it. Streaming is just, I, once I started making YouTube videos, I was like, oh, I don't know if I should keep streaming. Cause like, I, I really enjoy these YouTube videos now. Like. I, I've been really demotivated with streaming anyway, but I guess I'll just keep streaming once a week for now and then I can always stop streaming. This has reminded me how much I love streaming and I really don't want to quit. <laughs> Which I think is good because I really, really liked streaming when I started. And I really don't think that that's one of those things that I should just give up on. Because I really had a lot of fun with it and it's such a good way to just like talk to people. Um, definitely during COVID, it was really, really nice to have some friends to talk to at the end of the day. So, I don't know. Really, really fun. <laughs> I've just had a really good time. I feel like I haven't recorded a YouTube video in so long that I feel like I have a lot of stories to tell. <laughs> but, I don't know, this has been such a crazy week in like the best way possible. And, I don't know, I really hope I can do more things like this in the future. I think Kayla has more events planned, um, for the coming year. So hopefully I can be part of those as well, if she lets me. <laughs> um, I don't know, I'm just really excited. Everyone's really, really cool. And I've had the time of my life and I'll definitely be supporting everyone else that was part of the event. But I'll talk a bit about the build. <laughs> um, so I built, I, I was really unsure of what to build. I've had like the worst builder's block for forever. I just, everything I build doesn't look good enough in my head. I'm just, I've just become too picky is what I've noticed. So I was thinking for ages today, I was like, I don't know what to build. I want something that's good. I don't want it to be too small, but I don't want it to be too big. Like, I don't know why I want to do, but I finally decided like, oh, I should build something on water. Cause like we have the pond tool now and you can do that wherever you want. So then I built this and I actually think it looks really nice. It blends in really well with the houses around it. Cause I've built one of those like cottage things before you can see it in the back sometimes. And it's also one of the first videos on this channel, but I tried to make it match with that one a little bit. I do think it looks really nice. I really like it. So I'm very excited. I really like the landscaping on it. Um, I think it looks very green and very nice. <laughs> I saw someone else um, do something like this with um, a house that was on top of the water and they were really, really good at it and they made the rocks look really, really cool. So. That's what I tried to do. I hope it. I hope you think it looks good because it took a very long time. I spent so much time on the landscaping because um, landscaping is not a thing I usually do a lot. So I feel like it takes me so much longer than anything else. I feel like I can furnish decently quickly <laughs> if I know what I want, but landscaping just takes a long time because you're placing so many things and you're just placing things over and over and over again. <laughs> but I don't know. But I have a whole week off this week and then next week I have exams. So I really want to work on making some cool streams, uh, making some cool YouTube content. My next video is going to be a collab with some pretty cool YouTubers. Um, so that I am also very excited about. I still have to make the video though. I haven't even made the build yet. So that makes me feel a little bit nervous. Um, I was thinking about ideas already today. So hopefully I can finish the build tomorrow. <laughs> because I would feel nervous about having to finish it the day before it goes up, but I'll do my best. <laughs> but I'm very excited. I feel like I'm, I've am i gotten a lot of motivation back that I was really, really hoping to get back for a very long time. So I'm, I'm feeling good. And I really hope you enjoy my content because I've been, I'm, I'm just really excited about it and I cannot wait to make more, <laughs> which I think is a good thing because this has just been a really cool part of my life recently and it's given me something to do because I think I really need something to do with myself so that I'm not just doing school um, because otherwise I'm gonna go insane. So I think this is a fun thing. I think this is a good way to do that um, because it's creative and I like being creative and also I can play games, which is also fun. And I can also talk a lot, which is also a thing I've discovered I really like doing. <laughs> I really enjoy talking to myself for a long time. Um, but yeah, if you do want to hang out with me, 
in like a more interactive form you can hang out on my twitch streams i'm trying to stream more now so if you're interested i play a lot of sims um i might play some fall guys i don't know i have a lot of i have a lot of games i bought planet zoo today um i'm really just unsure of how it works though and i'm really struggling but it looks really fun and i really like animals so <laughs> Who knows, maybe I'll do a Planet Zoo stream, but I need to figure out how it works first or I'll be really embarrassed. <laughs> but thank you so much for hanging out with me. I really appreciate it. And I cannot wait to make more content in the future. Okay, goodbye.